despite controversies, the PlayStation 5 has been absolutely killing it with its PS3 remakes, such as Demon's Souls and The Last of Us Part 1. But there's so many more games of that generation that deserve to get that treatment as well, and with this feature, we'll take a look at 15 such games that need to be remade for the PS5. We have quite a bit to cover, so let's dive right into it. Uncharted 2 Among Thieves after a strong start with the first game, Naughty Dog really came into its own elements with the sequel. Uncharted 2 Among Thieves told an enthralling story punctuated with thrilling set pieces and memorable characters, and it's a game that surprisingly holds up well to this day. A PS5 remake could take full advantage of current-gen horsepower and deliver stunning visuals and smoothed-out gameplay, making for an experience that would feel completely new and fresh. Metal Gear Solid 4 Guns of the Patriots Metal Gear Solid is making a comeback with an upcoming remake of Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater. But the entry that is in most desperate need of a remake has to be Metal Gear Solid 4 Guns of the Patriots, and that's not just for introducing the game to a new audience, but also because Metal Gear Solid 4 is locked to the PS3 and there's no legitimate way for current-gen console owners to enjoy this classic. We're hoping that the next remake after Delta Snake Eater will be this one, so there's no harm in keeping your fingers crossed as well. Enslaved Odyssey to the West before Ninja Theory worked on Hellblade and eventually got acquired by Microsoft, it delivered an amazing action-adventure in the form of Enslaved Odyssey to the West. Released in 2010, Enslaved was a game that provided a fresh take on the classic novel Journey to the West. With its interesting gameplay ideas based on cooperation and fresh world design, Enslaved was a game that had plenty of merits to its name. Of course, it wasn't a flawless experience by any means, which is why we need a remake for this classic. Ninja Theory could use its current-gen technology and learnings from subsequent projects to create a game that's bigger and better than the original in every regard. Red Dead Redemption Rockstar Games delivered an amazing Wild West epic with Red Dead Redemption. John Marston's tale of redemption is worth experiencing through to the end, but sadly it's a game that's locked on the PS3 and Xbox. While there is a remastered version available for current-gen consoles, it's a bare-bones port that is in dire need of substantial improvement. As such, having a ground-up remake for PS5 and Xbox Series X and S would be really appreciated by both returning fans and those who played Red Dead Redemption 2. Dead Space 2 EA Motive delivered an excellent reimagining of the first Dead Space with its recent remake, and we can't help but ask for a similar remake of the second game as well. Fans of the franchise would agree that Dead Space 2 was the series at its absolute peak, and getting to experience all of that through a new lens is something that has us salivating at the very thought of it all. Given the success of the first remake, it's obviously possible that something like this might happen in the near future, so keep your fingers crossed. Fallout 3 Set against the backdrop of a post-apocalyptic US, Fallout 3 takes players on an unforgettable journey filled with tons of meaningful quests and characters that will stay with you long after the credits roll. Despite those merits, it's not easy to play Fallout 3 for players accustomed to modern gaming conveniences, which is why we so desperately need a remake of this classic. With no new single-player Fallout game in sight, we could do with a reimagining of Fallout 3 for the time being. Sleeping Dogs Sleeping Dogs might feel like a cheap GTA clone at first glance, but the moment you look past that initial veneer, you'll find a surprisingly fun open world with a complex web of different mechanics that come together to create something special. It's well and truly a game of its time, and deserves to be reintroduced to a brand new audience with a fresh coat of paint. It's a difficult task, considering that the original developer United Front Games closed its doors in 2016, but there's no harm in having some hopes, right? Resistance Fall of Man Insomniac Games' Resistance series was Sony's answer to Microsoft's Gears of War, and the similarities ranging from post-apocalyptic backdrop to the opposing alien forces are readily apparent, but despite those similarities, Resistance Fall of Man is a solid first-person shooter with plenty of spectacle and set pieces which makes it such a great game to remake at a time when PlayStation is known for its cinematic blockbuster experiences. Apart from that, Sony has a very evident lack of first-person shooters in its roster of exclusive IPs, so bringing Resistance back would also help diversify its portfolio. Vanquish 
Platinum Games is known for its slick action and spectacle like seen in Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, and Vanquish is a game that's emblematic of those very strengths. This third-person action game features a rather unique gameplay loop that makes cover-based shooting an extremely fun activity through the use of power slides and slow motion, and it's a game that has surprisingly stood the test of time. That being said, not many people actually tried Vanquish back in the day, and a full-fledged remake with modern graphics and smoother animations would be right up the alley of many gamers. Dark Souls 1 from Software perfected what they started with Demon's Souls in 2011's Dark Souls, and it instantly became a game for the history books. Thanks to a meticulously crafted world with distinct levels and memorable boss fights, Dark Souls was able to win the hearts of thousands upon thousands of fans. But it would be wrong to say that Dark Souls doesn't have its fair share of problems, both stemming from the technology at the time and also a few quirks related to its design. But with a full-fledged remake, From Software can take its learnings and create a game that's better than before. Infamous One Sucker Punch Productions of Ghost of Tsushima fame made its reputation as one of Sony's top talents through the Infamous series, which provided a thrill ride through an open world filled with interesting missions and side activities, alongside an interesting morality system that significantly changes your playstyles and skill trees. The first game has arguably aged the worst, which is why it would require a full-fledged remake for the PS5. Motorstorm Motorstorm was a rather unique off-road racing experience where players got to choose from different vehicle types to win the race. It combines high-octane racing with destruction mechanics to make for an experience that's unlike anything, and it retains that status even after all these years. Between this and the fact that not a lot of players actually picked it up back in the day, Motorstorm is the perfect candidate for a full-fledged remake that could introduce this experience to a brand new audience. L.A. Noir. L.A. Noir is undoubtedly one of the most creative games in Rockstar's wide array of open-world offerings, and a lot of that falls down on the impressive detective work that players get to do in the myriad of cases available to solve across its vast space. The developer used cutting-edge facial modeling to make conversations with subjects more meaningful, but many of those ideas were obviously limited by the technology of the time. But now that we have modern engines like Unreal Engine 5 with features like MetaHuman toolkits, a remake of L.A. Noir could finally fulfill its complete creative vision in earnest. The Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion the Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion is an expansive RPG with a complex web of systems and dozens of quests for players to complete. It's safe to say that it was also ahead of its time in so many ways, which is why it is the perfect fit for a full-fledged remake for current generation systems. Getting to explore the mystical beauty of its world in high definition will be a dream come true for fans of the genre, and while the chances of it all happening anytime soon are pretty slim, we can at least hope. Batman Arkham Asylum Rocksteady's debut Batman Arkham game might just be its most focused game in the series. Each room in the asylum is meticulously designed, and the interconnected nature of the levels combined with memorable boss fights really make it feel like a living, breathing place. But it's also true that the game hasn't aged all that well after so many years and subsequent entries in the series. So a remake that brings the features and mechanics from modern games would result in an instant hit. That's all for now. If you enjoy what you saw, please hit the like button. And if you're new to the channel, now is a great time to subscribe. We upload brand new videos every single day. After subscribing, don't forget to enable all notifications by clicking the bell icon. Thanks for watching this video, and we'll see you next time, right here on Gaming Bolt.